Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today is 8th March and it is a special day because it's International Women's Day today and it is the day when we celebrate all the women around us, whether she's your mother, sister, a friend, a colleague, or any, any women who is in your circle. It's my day, it's all for your day, and I just wanted to wish you first um, Happy International Women's Day. And I also wanted to quickly share about some of the women who inspire me and who have helped me in one way or other to be at a stage where I am today. Uh, one of the motivation that actually made me make this video is as you can see uh, there, I have some flowers um, next to the TV. Um, I have a neighbor who is um, probably would be around in her 70s. Um, she knocked at my door this morning and she brought me these beautiful flowers and she br also brought me some cookies. And she said that she wanted to wish me uh, a Women's Day and then she said that I should feel special, I am special, and that I should celebrate myself. Um, I find the gesture very cute. Um, I think that was a reminder for me that uh, there are women in your circle who would always try to uplift you, who would always uh, be there for you. So it just um, made me realize um, or made me think about the women who are in my circle and who influenced me a lot or who um, have already influenced me and made me who I am. So if I have to talk about the women who have inspired me throughout my life, <laughs> would be um, uh, then it would be a long list. I have been inspired. I have been privileged enough to be surrounded with a lot of amazing women, amazing girls in my life. But if I have to start with someone, that would be my mom. My mom is a housewife and um, right now she is in my hometown, which is um, in the mountains in the northern Pakistan, in Gilgit, Pakistan. And I am trying my best to uh, apply for a visit visa for her to visit me this year in Germany. She has never been to Germany and I hope this year is the year when she gets to see uh, my life here and the country itself. Um, but that is something I'm working on. But anyways, right now she is uh, back home and um, she is on top of the list who have inspired me or gives who gives me motivation every single day um, because I have seen her how hard she has worked for all of her children. I'm the youngest one. So um, I've seen her. She's a strict mom, but she has worked very hard for all of us to give us the best life that um, she could. Um, maybe I will also quickly share one video that I made with her last year when I visited home. Um, last year, July, I visited home and then uh, we did a family trip to one of the local touristic areas there. Uh, so I'm from the north and that is the most beautiful, one of the most beautiful parts of Pakistan. Uh, so we made a trip um, up to some areas in the mountains and I made a short video with her, which I'm going to share. <laughs> if you're someone who does not speak Burishiski, um then you you maybe did not understand. So in this video we're speaking in Burishiski and I'm just asking her uh, how was her day because it's not every day she gets to go and do sightseeing in her own city or in her own state. Um, she's very busy with her household work um, and also the culture that is there, that women are more involved in the household things, that they don't get to go out a lot or whenever they want. 
So we made a trip to the places that uh, she adores um, in our state. And I was just asking in the video, um, how was the trip and how everything went? And she was just saying that she had a very good day. So that is one of uh, uh, one of the memories that I uh, that are very close to my heart and that I uh, really wanted to share here today. Um, I can share like thousands of things about my mom and how she is uh, one of the iron ladies in my hometown. My hometown, uh, it's a remote area in Pakistan, but where the women are the strongest, you would see a lot of examples where women are running their small uh, shops or small um, kind of restaurants. They're even working with the bricks. They're even working uh, with the woodwork. Um, they're doing everything. They are doing everything that anyone can do despite the gender. So uh, I have had the privilege to grow up in a place like that. So other than my mom, there are many other women. For example, my sister, um, she's an amazing mom. She is doing amazing things for the community, sharing her knowledge, sharing her skills with them. She also used to run um, a learning center to give the opportunity to the kids in the town who don't have access to the big institutions for uh, the extra help they need after the school. So. Um, she has done so many amazing things in her life as well so she was also one of my role models uh, while growing up so you know how people say that uh, for for women to be leaders of tomorrow they need to see the uh, female uh, role models in the form of a ceo or in the form of someone at the higher level I do agree to it to some extent, for example, at my work, it does inspire me if I, if, if my manager is a um, female manager that I, uh, that could inspire me, it does help. Um, I completely agree with it. And even in my company, there are a lot of women at the very senior roles uh, who do inspire me a lot, but it's not just the people who have uh, become CEO they can inspire you. To me, the inspiration comes from any women um, around me in my hometown or in Germany where I live or in my friend circle, any women, um, despite whatever her uh, career level is, if she is doing something amazing in her life, if she's inspiring me with any of her qualities, it's enough for me. She inspires me and I would remember that person always in my in my life. For example, uh, one of my um, my current boss at my job, she gave me um, she gifted me this book uh, when I completed one year at the company. So this was a very nice gesture. And this also shows that how she wants me to um, how she sees me in the future and she wants to uh, she she wants me to be a good future uh, women leader. So there are a lot of examples um, around us who inspires us every day. You don't only uh, uh, you don't have to be a woman to be inspired by a woman, right? Anyone can be inspired um, by a woman. Like um, a son can be inspired by. A, his mother, his sister, his friend, his partner, his colleague, or anyone. I personally know a lot of men who always give examples of the women in their life and how they have affected their life positively. And you know, when people say there's always a woman behind this successful man, I truly believe that because in order to progress in this society, men and women both have to work um, shoulder to shoulder so it's impossible for someone to be at that top without the support of their mother their sister a friend or anyone um i also give credit um to my dad uh who's no longer with us but he was the biggest feminist i've ever known um i think he didn't even know the word feminist but he was the biggest feminist at least for me because he has never differentiated between his daughters and sons whenever it came to quality education whenever it came to uh, job opportunities or anything 
And just to remind you that I belong to a remote area. So whenever I say um, differentiating in terms of education, it, it still is a big topic in those areas. So uh, while growing up, he, he also got a lot of criticism from a lot of people, but he did not listen to anyone. And he gave uh, me, my sister and my brothers, all of us the equal opportunities, equal love and everything. And um, I am forever grateful to him and his um, hard work and everything that he has done for us. So today celebrating Women's Day, I also want to celebrate all those men who have been there for us who have always had our back, our brothers, our dad, our friends, our partners. Um, I also want to wish you a happy International Women's Day because we would not be able to celebrate this day without your contribution um, in our lives. So happy International uh, Women's Day to all of you. And I do wish that we live in a society where we are always helping each other, building a society together without um, hating um, each other's gender. Um, I have so much to share, but I have very little time. I, um, I have some other things to do as well. So I have many things to share, but I would, very, I would really appreciate if you could share um, the story or one comment about one person, one uh, female person in your life who has inspired you, who has helped you in any way, uh, then I would love to know about uh, them as well. So please leave a comment and let me know. Um, and my best wishes to all of them already. <laughs> uh, but thank you so much for watching. Uh, do leave a comment for me and um, I wish you again happy International Women's Day and have a good weekend ahead. Thank you. Bye.